to Motown. We are in Detroit, Michigan for EA Sports. I'm James Sabalski, and the Red Wings are ready to roll. The Red Wings have won the draw, and we are now underway. The Bruins gain control of the puck. Slides it across to Steele. Long lead pass up the center. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Mrazek. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive, he's competitive, and he wins the battle. Lincoln, it's going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. McAvoy's able to steady his team defensively and still contribute points. Larkin's foot speed can make him dangerous, and that's his wheel zone ability. I'm expecting one of these two players to be the biggest impact for their team tonight. Back to you guys. Moves it around along the half wall. Boston's got the puck in the corner. The Red Wings have it from their own end. Nice zone entry from the left. And he takes the dish. And he takes the feed. Moves the puck to steal. On the attack along the boards. What a steal in his own end. Puck dumped in. The Bruins gain possession along the wall. Takes the pass. Takes the feed. Saka's moving the puck through his own zone. Moves it to the middle. The Red Wings move the puck in the defensive zone. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Slick feed. Moves it over to Zaka. The Red Wings gain possession in their own end. Rasmussen's got the puck in his own zone. And now he moves it quickly to Comper. And he slides it quickly to Edvinson. Here's a shot. Lankinen's made a great save, and even better is the redirect to the corner. Carlos got the puck through the neutral zone. That's moved to the middle, and that chance is blocked. Detroit's in transition. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Boston's looking to break out of their own end. And here's the pass to McKenna. Poked away in the neutral zone. Feeds the puck to Trennan. Delayed penalty looming. Whistle stops the play. He might argue because he thought this was a physical play along the boards, but any times you see the numbers, you gotta slow up. Back of the way as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Detroit's got it now. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. Larkin's made a fantastic play, James, and he's falling to the ice. He's got the puck on his stick, and he still has the ability to lower that bottom hand and find a way to redirect the puck to the net. I mean, that's tenacity, that's courage, and finding a way to compete and will your way to the net. Slides the puck over to Lindholm. Boston's on the attack. Moves it quickly over to Torpchenko. Let's see what the officials are calling. Another stick infraction, and you know that coaches don't like this one. A product of not being in good position, reaching, and then taking the trip because you weren't moving your feet. Carries the puck up through center. Grabs control of it at the point. Oh, what a stop as he uses his paddle to sweat it away. And he slides it quickly to Sider. Delayed penalty coming up here by the official. Whistle blows, stopping the play. When your opponent doesn't have the puck, you can't interfere with their forward progress too much. You can cheat a little bit, James, but that's over the top. And from off the wing, it comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. Oh, what a paddle save on the play! It's amazing to me how he always looks like he's in the right position because he tracks and reads the play so well, and this time he gets in front of the puck that's right in the middle of the ice as the shooter's got a dangerous opportunity. Still has possession. Detroit's across the blue line. Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck. Tries to feed it over to Cup. 
Harper. Grabbed along the board by Steele. Here's a short pass to Haig. Handles the pass. Along the half wall with the puck. Oh, excellent play and goal there. Slides it quickly to Comfer. And time expires on the power play. Both teams back to even. Well, this power play unit was stagnant, James. They didn't create any offense. They didn't get any pucks to the net, and there were really no chances. Broken up in the neutral zone by Quinn. Quick feed to Tube. Moves it to the middle. And that turns off a twig in front of the net. Morazic's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Just here in the late stages of this frame, still scoreless in this one. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Bruins look to start the transition game. Chatfield's taking it from his own end. The Red Wings pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Solid check to slow him down. Chatfield's got it against the boards. And that ricochets off a twig in front. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Sends it quickly to Sider. Pokes it away in his own end. The Bruins will play it from the defensive zone. Handles it again. With some open space at center. Sends the pass in front. The shot! That's kicked away with a pad by Morazic. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Centers glide into the dot as a face-off ready to resume play. And off the draw, they'll take possession. Up along the wing. There's the buzzer, 20 minutes in the books, second period just around the corner. And the official seems about ready to drop the puck on period number two. Who will be the first to light the lamp here as play gets underway in the second? All right, Pounder, how would you assess this game through the first 20 minutes played? Well, this is my kind of game, James. Real stingy, defensively shut down in the neutral zone, close out the blue lines, and don't get anything going offensively. It's been the same for both teams, so pretty boring game for the crowd. Not very fun for us. Here's a shot! Gets in front of it! Takes a shot! And scores! Well, talk about a friendly ping right there! Oh, uh, yeah, it's all about the bounces, isn't it, James? And you got to get the right one, and that one is in his favor. Well, this is a really smart shot through traffic, James. The recognition of the net front presence in screen, and the goalie drops to the butterfly position, really tries to make himself as big as possible, hoping that the puck just hits him because he can't see it. The Bruins are up by one here in period number two. Uh, and these are the games you have to learn how to win. You know that this is going to be a dogfight right to the end, and it's going to be the details that make all the difference in the world. Puck picked up by Sider. Shot, and the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. There's a firm collision. Torchenko's got it in the offensive zone. And he takes a shot, and the puck dies with the trapper save. Still plenty of time left in this frame. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Larkin's quick stick off the draw wins possession. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Puck scooped up by Zaka. Through center along the wing. Moves it to Carlo. Gains the zone. Pass out front. And that goes off a stick. The Red Wings have it now. And he takes the pass. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Scooped up along the wall by Haig. 
And they send it right back to him. Change up, change up. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Quick pass to Siegenthaler. The Red Wings will play it in their own end. Here's an odd man rush. Fires it on net. Sends one up to McKenna. Boston's got it in the neutral zone. Jostles the puck loose. From the point, looks to make something happen. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Quick feed to Bertuzzi. Into the offensive zone, down the right wing. Picked up along the wall by McKenna. Chatfield stick handling in his own zone. And the puck's kicked free. Broke off at center by Edmondson. Tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Zaka's got it along the wing. Here's a pass to the middle, and that's off target. Detroit's got a hold of the puck now. Gains the zone on the left wing. The Bruins have it behind the net. Quick pass over to McKenna. Detroit's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Taken along the wall by Zaka. Taken by Valeno. Right in the slot. Oh, what a stop by Lakenen. The Red Wings take possession here in the open ice. Moves it quickly over to Trenton. for your team. The rebound pops out after the shot. You have to have the hard stick be heavy on it with it on the ice, battling to beat for it. He does it and he buries it. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. We got a tie game. Boston's won it. And now it's grabbed by Lindholm. And that's poked away. The Bruins gain possession. Quick shot. Well saved made by Morazic. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. This crowd tonight, I mean, every night here, they are just on fire with another sellout. They are on fire. James, I like the way you said that, a little high pitch, because why everyone in here is high pitch? Because they're winning and they're being successful. You can see it by the number of jerseys that have been bought and are being worn, and that's when you know that they're cheering on their star players. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. With possession along the wall. Had a lot of offensive zone possession time, and you gotta think that he knows he's one goal away from his next milestone. Passes over to Steele. The Bruins played along the boards, and he was ready for that save. Backhander in front, denies him again. I'm not sure if anyone's helping him out there, but he's dialed in and doing it all himself, making consecutive saves. Here in the late goings of the period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Detroit's going to start with the puck in their own end. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Here's a short pass to Debrinkit. Hammers a shot. Detroit's got it behind the net. Moves it to Raymond. Boston's grabbed a hold of the puck. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Gets it over to Raymond. Boston's got the puck. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Mrazic's been dominant in the crease tonight. He's turned away a lot of high danger shots and he's really found a way to build some momentum for his team, giving him a real opportunity to win. Puck grab by Siegenthaler. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Let's see the call here. Late in the period, in a close game, a tough penalty to take, James. But if they can just kill it off and get to the intermission, they can reset to start the next period. The Bruins win the draw. Carlos has been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. There's the whistle. Let's get the official to sit. 
conclusion. A tight game at the end of a period and you take a penalty. Your PKers have to come up huge and get you to the intermission. Puck picked up by Siegenthaler. Quick pass to Raymond. Here we go, pucks in deep. Pushes it across to Zaka. All right, we've played now 40 minutes in this one and still a critical 20 minutes still needs to be played. Go stretch your legs, grab that final snack because the third period is just around the corner. Here we go, period number three. It's been a back and forth affair and it's been a fun one tonight. Handles the puck. This Buck James, he has pulled the goaltender right out of position and he can just slide it on by. Detroit's gone up by one here in period number three. Uh, you know that they recognize that they've got the lead in the third period, so they have to be defensively responsible, but you can't just sit back and protect. You got to be aggressive when you get the moment and take advantage of it. Puck scooped up by Sider. And that pass goes off a stick. Taken by McAvoy. The Bruins gain control of the puck against the wall. And they remain a goal behind as the power play comes up short. Well, the only good thing about that power play unit was they got in zone and got set up. But you can have all the possession time in the world, but if it doesn't generate opportunity, it means nothing. Sends one over, picks off the pass in the defensive zone. Feeds it over to Saka. Quick feed to McKenna. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Directed over to Larkin. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Boston's got the puck. On the breakaway! Stopped on the breakaway! What a save he made there! Well, I loved how he challenged the shooter on this, James. He didn't sit back in his net. He came right out to the top of the paint and said, if you're going to beat me, you got to find room. Oh, the out of the play! Wow! Oh, that's a true competitor save. Just when you think that he's completely out he comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive. Moves it quickly over to Saka. Comfers lugging the puck. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Oh, what a close save by Lankinen. What an incredible save in a high danger scoring area. I mean, right in the slot, he's in perfect position to make that club save. Center in the front, and it goes off a stick and off target. Detroit's moving it along the wing. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Can't maintain possession. Picked up along the boards by Steele. Sends it ahead to Torpchenko. Center and Pierre scores! What a play! That puck is on and off his stick in a hurry, and it needs to be from that low zone slot area. James just beats the goaltender because it gets off his stick so fast. The Bruins are wheeling, dealing, and have tied things up here in the third. I like that wheeling and dealing, James, because they've had possession throughout this entire game, the majority of it, and their opponent has been chasing it, but leading. So they get the equalizer, and the momentum is certainly in their favor. And he takes the feed. Big time stop by Lankinen. Here's a short pass to Rasmussen. Feeds the puck across to Torpchenko. The Bruins play it along the wing. And that pass attempt is deflected. Moves it to Haig. Tipped in front. Denies him. I love the way that he battles and competes for this puck, James. I mean, he loses it for a second, then he finds it, and he makes a save. Oh, and somehow he gets a save of it and keeps them at bay. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Takes a shot. Gets in front of it for the block. Textbook poke check by Carlo. 
And now it's grabbed by Kurt. Detroit's looking to break out. Sends a pass over. Fires it! Big stop by the goaltender right in front. on the schedule, and I hear tickets are still available. A few select seats, so get them now. It should be a good one coming up. More than half the frame has been played here. The Red Wings are looking to build on this one-goal lead. Moves it on over to Bergren. And they continue to apply pressure here. Chatfield's got it in the defensive end. You can feel the energy in the building right now in this tight game. The pressure is on. You have to find a way to embrace it at this moment. The Bruins have it behind the cage. Quick pass to Chatfield. And now it's to Tube. Gets a hold of the puck from the right side. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Played big in the moment there. Detroit's got a hold of the puck. Now over to Raymond. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. A chance! Great stop by Lankinen! He does a great job of having sound positional play based on where the puck is on that low inner slot. And he makes himself big, takes away the holes, and makes a save. The Bruins have it now. And he moves it up to Marchenko. Takes the bump and loses control of the puck. And he hangs on to the puck. To break, it's moving it ahead. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. He is so dangerous when the puck is on his stick in the offensive zone, but he tries one too many moves and he loses the puck. Inside of the last minute here in this third. Takes a shot. Oh, a save on the play! Oh, that's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about complete and finding a way to get to the puck.